guys welcome back to my youtube channel i hope you're all doing well i've actually already filmed this video went to go edit it and two of the clips were not there it was meant to go up sunday that is the reason why i haven't uploaded anything so i'm really filming it today so i purchased the mark hill where's the front i don't even know the mark hill deep waver look how amazing sabrina looks on the front there i absolutely love the original mermaid waver but i'm always running late so unless i've like planned ahead and i'm running early i just can't do it because it does take a little it takes longer than like curling your hair or straightening it so i thought this one because it's bigger it might be quicker and i can have waves in my hair more often so i thought i'd do one side normal mermaid waver and then one side with the deep waver so you guys can see like a direct comparison between the two this is the normal mermaid waver and this is the new deep waver as you can see the barrels on this one are a lot thicker than they are on this one i'm gonna start with the deep waver it's actually quite heavy to be honest i do like the mix and match though because if you're going away you can like put different barrels in so this side's gonna be deep waver this side's gonna be normal mermaid waver i'm also gonna section my hair just because my hair is quite thick my hair is actually greasy but it's like the best time for doing this hairstyle because it adds to the beachy waviness and it also covers up the grease a little bit so i'm just gonna grab the first section here just put it on like that and then I just work my way down my head. I'll show you what I mean in a second. It's really hard to like talk and look at you guys whilst this is in here. So I hold it for about 10 slash 12 seconds. And then I go, just go to like the last wave. And I put it in that last wave, if that makes sense. Just show you again what I mean. So I'm going to take this off now. So you see I've got that last wave bit there. I put the top one back into that wave. Ooh, let's just move that over a bit. Need to that last section. So I'm just going to go like that. Ooh. Look at it. I love the wave that this gives. I just take like a normal size section of hair that I know will wave. Obviously it depends what kind of wave you want to go for. Obviously you want to go for a looser wave, don't hold it on for as long. But I like to go for quite a tight wave. What I did notice last time and this time is that with the... Let me just take this one out and I'll finish my sentence. I'm not very good at... Ooh, look at it. What I did notice last time and this time is what you get with get with the normal mermaid wave it's like a line at the top sometimes you have to straighten it out depends on how bad it is but with this wave you don't get any of that which i love because sometimes it can be really annoying that line i have really 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 been i'm mean, ignoring about getting is it curtain bands like what matilda jeff has and i've seen them all over tiktok and i think it looks so nice but i just don't know if it would suit me but i'm so tempted i feel like i need a switch up with my hair so and my hair grows so quickly like especially my fringe so maybe i'll just do it maybe should i just do it maybe i'll do it tomorrow i hate going so close to my ear guys like i actually hate it does anybody else have a fear like me my sister was straightening my hair and she got my ear and oh my god it hurt so much it went all like crispy tmi i know disgusting i literally love them like i honestly love them so much i did have a top section and then we'll move on to the normal mermaid waver. How are you guys? I feel like I haven't sat down and spoken to you guys in a while. Any of you back at school? I always see all the school kids walking past. If any of you are at school, how are you finding it? My sister's school actually had a case. I'm thinking of bringing like weekly vlogs like back once a month or something just because I love vlogging. It's like the only time that I really catch up with you guys on my life and talk to you guys and chat rubbish to you guys. I'll pick a week of the month where I'm I mean, well, most busiest, but probably won't be that busy. So. is still longer than curling your hair because obviously you've got to do each sec section separately whereas when you're curling your hair you just take that whole section and hold it for 10 however long many seconds i get so scared going close to my forehead because i actually burnt my forehead with this previously and it really bloody hurt okay i'm gonna hold it for less seconds just because it's a smaller section of hair so about five seconds should do it so this is the side with the deep waver i love 
I'm obsessed. I've got the next extra on my hair and I'm not going to talk through this side too much. I'll just quickly whisper it but I'm literally just going to do exactly the same as I did on this side of my hair. <laughs> I definitely need to take smaller sections with this one compared to the other barrel. Obviously that one is a bit bigger. see here what I mean about the line okay, so the hair is all finished and this is the difference in the waves um but look I'll show you can you see what I mean about you get those indents I really can't be able to straighten them up because realistically I'm not going anywhere with hair like this am I I've got like a lot looser wave and here you've got a tighter beachier wave I'll just do like a little pan round for you guys so you can see I really really I just love both I didn't actually think they would look that 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 different until i did it on this side as well and now i can really see the difference between the two this one definitely gives your hair a bit more volume and you can see that um the length the difference in length between them two whereas this one's a bit looser this one's a bit tighter so it really just does depend on what vibe you're going for and i'm glad that i've done it side by side because last time i literally just did that one but now i can actually see the difference between the two it's really nice i feel like this side is more of a side but i would wear I was going for like drinks or like out for a nice dinner and this is more of like a to be fair I would wear either but I'd probably opt for this one more and this is more like a cooler like day vibe. Obviously depending on your hair length I would say if you've got short hair go for this one if you've got longer hair just go for whichever one you prefer the vibe. We hope you guys enjoyed this video and it was useful to any of you if you were thinking about purchasing either of them to be fair but if you were if you do own this one and you want to see the difference between the two i hope this has helped you make a decision on whether you want it or not if you were wondering what this one is like because i was before i bought it i'm so glad i get there because i absolutely love the outcome of it and this hairstyle is definitely going to be and obviously not both of them together but this one is definitely going to be featured in some videos soon thank you guys so so much for watching please do let me know if you enjoyed this video obviously i know it's very different to my other videos like fashion and thrifting and stuff so i really hope you guys enjoy this one too but yeah thank you to everyone who's made it this far in the video follow me on instagram if you aren't already it's just sorrelwj and i'll see you all in my next video bye